An update on a local 10 News investigation into alleged misconduct by a Miami-Dade firefighter. Two colleagues have accused him of attacking them in the firehouse, and now a third firefighter has come forward. Local 10 News investigator Amy Viteri first brought us this story, and she's live with what she's learned. Amy. Well, that's right. It's now a total of three female firefighters who have filed complaints alleging one of their co-workers touched them inappropriately and tried to force himself on them. Late this afternoon, I was able to speak by phone with the third woman to come forward and file a complaint. She says, like the other cases, her incident happened several years ago. But unlike the other two alleged attacks, which happened here at Fire Station 20, she says hers happened outside of work. We first told you in May about two women, both Miami-Dade firefighters, who alleged they were sexually attacked by a fellow firefighter. He's a predator. Now, Local 10 News has learned since our initial report, a third woman has come forward with a similar complaint against firefighter Jose Lopez. Lopez has been on administrative duty since April of 2022 when the department received those complaints. Here's what he had to say when we asked him about the allegations last month. You have to go to headquarters, Miami Dade Fire Rescue Headquarters, and talk to them. In a statement to Local 10 News, Fire Chief Ray Jadala wrote in part, in light of new information from a third person who has come forward, MDFR has included these new details to the ongoing investigation. Allegations of this nature are taken very seriously, and this type of conduct dishonors the mission and values of our department. I was fighting as hard as I could to get him off of me because, you know, in my mind, I didn't want to get raped. The two women who initially came forward allege the attacks happened over 10 years ago. Neither reported them at the time, they say, over fears it would affect them in the workplace. It wasn't until they met years later and learned they had similar experiences, they say they decided to come forward. It's the same guy, the same station. Both women, who we're not identifying, say Lopez attacked them on different occasions during their shifts at Fire Station 20 in Northeast Miami-Dade. It was like a horror movie. And the third woman told us she ultimately decided to come forward after seeing our report last month. She says she believes there are other women out there affected by this. A spokesperson for Miami-Dade Fire Rescue says they want anyone with details about this case involving Jose Lopez to contact them. They want them to reach out to the department's Division of Professional Standards. We're live in Northeast Miami-Dade. Amy Viteri, Local 10 News. Okay.